Why don't we throw in Felix in there too? Why not? That I do like, like the little. Boss fight. Yeah. Okay, time oh. for a boss battle. So no la no laser swords. No blades. That sucks. Let's see what do we have to work with here. Uh, a little over 10k. Let's see. Do I have? What do I have to start off with anyway? Option. Nothing apparently. Damn. You know I. Started from scratch, you know, being a one, one of those uh, raw gameplay and commentary kind of people. <laughs> That's the hard part, you know. It's not not the uh, editing. The hard part is the raw reactionary commentary. Absolutely. I mean, anybody can edit a video, but to come up with things to say on the spot—that's tough. That's hard work. So, I do want to say that... Yeah? One of those things in like that like optional equip where the speed booster was, I might have been looking away for a little bit, and when I glanced over, I had to do a double take just to make sure it didn't look like what I thought it looked like. Why? What do you well, think it said? I mean, I think it was the act of camouflage, but... Thank you, Harry. <laughs> I... My faith in humanity has been restored. Thank you. Long story short, I thought one of the things in that equip spot looked like a weird blocky uh, dildo. But, then again, what I if what it actually crazy. was... Oh, I'm smart. I bought the equipment and didn't actually put it on. Look at me. Eh. Call this, uh, you know... This is a lesson. challenge run. There you go. But hey, nothing's impossible. I mean, I am playing as the waifu. And the champion yeah. as well. Nothing is impossible with a champion. <laughs> Thanks, Harry. <laughs> Well timed. <laughs> I can I can make that happen on command with the D pad. Oh man, just <laughs> I almost thought she was like no. <laughs> Nothing is it no. <laughs> so what do you think Harry would order if he went to a bar and bought a drink? Probably the most expensive champagne just to flex, hoping Lino would be there to witness his uh Authority. Do you think uh, Harry has good taste in waifus? I mean, I would say that if he was picking them based on their fight fighting ability, no. But I definitely feel like um, Lena is like a fun example of a Sundari that isn't overly like. Yeah. OMG stereotypical waifu, uh, uh, insert thing here, kind yeah. of character. Yeah, the one that could just easily KO everybody with a single punch. Very good stuff. I but... actually have a model kit of the Lena gun sniper, and let me really? tell you, it's hard to keep standing up. No wonder she has difficulty in those matches. Like, imagine this little, like, skinny raptor zoid with a fuck ton of guns on the back of it, like... That thing didn't come with, like, little plastic stands that... No! You gotta do that yourself! <laughs> Jesus. You gotta earn this, uh, display model. There we go. The bosses are so fucking easy. And Harry and actually he... lived! Nothing is impossible no when you have a champion! You, you see how she says, no decree, then you cannot defeat me? That, um, <laughs> uh, what's the word, validates my idea that she could be a rapper. Yeah. Because of course... Mm -hmm. You know what's funny is, like, I, I guess I have, like, a... I don't want to say fetish, but like an attraction to women who can perform because I, 
If you know, I commissioned a uh, artwork of Lilith performing a rock concert for Kagura. Yeah, I've seen that. Yep. Yeah. I mean, I guess that would explain a lot. You know. Yeah, like it's not like a sexual attraction, but it's like I I like women who have talent. Like, that's why I like I like Lady Gaga so much because like she's yeah. I I have seen her live in concert twice now, so I can tell you twice. even even not in the studio, she's got some good talent. You know what my favorite like stuff that she put out is what? Um, she did like this album with um. Shit, why can't I remember this name? But it was like it sounded like old stu stu cool so, classical duets. Is it, is it Tony Bennett? I think so, yeah. I have it's cheek to cheek. Yeah, that one. I like have that, that physically. I, I I own the album well the album, the um the C D of that. Yeah. Yeah, no, it was fun, because like she did a duet of um Anything Goes, which is a song that was featured in uh, none other than Indiana Jones. Oh, yeah. Does she actually sing Chinese, too? She sings in English, but still, it's, I mean, that's just cool that she did the song with Tony Bennett. But yeah, no, it's cool because, like, my grandfather was a big jazz uh, fan. He played a lot yeah. of jazz music on his channel. Uh, God rest his soul. He was a good man. Yeah. Where's the damn dark... Here he is. Okay, there he's fucking 66000 to buy Harry's dark horn. Damn. That guy's got expensive taste. Well. He is the man destined to be king. It's funny how, like, that was my... Like, that whole line was my, uh... What's the word? Like the moniker or the like like my YouTube catchphrase if you will yeah like that intro catchphrase yeah I mean it works I guess you know it's like my name is Love Game or PD1 Piranha if you prefer I am a man just to be king <laughs> I'm yeah, working on time. my uh, I'm working on my Grant George impression right now so <laughs> no, I'm working on that uh <clears throat> Be your date for the night, princess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sounds good, man. Yeah, I hope um, to. Uh, again, more and more shout outs to my good, true and honest friend, uh, Suck You Baby. The, uh, oh, yeah, who Suck I you Baby. Greatly salute for being a Marine. Oh, man. I still gotta wait and. Tell her what I need to tell her in person. Oh yeah, I can't wait to have like a fighting game lobby with all of us so we can make like our joke we've been planning on making because like we want to make the joke of like see because different branches of the military have like these little jokes they make against each other like okay what kind of crayons do you eat? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and another one that I would do with a, a former marine or a marine because. Uh, it's an ac like an acronym style joke. It stands for my ass rides and navy equipment. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you know, what the fuck? A little playful. Why is there? Huh? What the hell? It's Things it's, going it's, a little. It's like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I thought nothing was impossible if you had a champion. I thought so too. You're not going anywhere. Go. I I know he didn't say. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> was that actually Harry saying that or? No, that was Albane. I mean, it, it just seemed to happen every time his face popped up, and I just imagined him like going from, "No, help me." You're not going anywhere. No, that was all being Nimbus. Hmm. Go. Oh my god. Wendy's Chili. The Mustang. I'm a fat man that can't walk. 
and blah, <laughs> blah, blah, and this and that. You know, it, it, it gets old after a while. <laughs> I wonder. Would would uh, wings be able to walk before Momokun learns to run? Maybe. I mean, he is a 500-pound man that can barely walk. Holy shit! He actually is 500 pounds. Well, I don't know if he's that big, but you know, he's he's a sizable fellow. Oh yeah. There definitely ain't no picking him up. What if a Tager player managed to learn like some super secret technique for air dashing before before he was able to before Momokun was able to run? I don't know about that, but I feel like I'll be able to pull off an astral finish with bang on you before Momokun learns to run. I could believe it. <laughs> Oh man, this is getting tense. Shit. Not tense anymore. Thanks, anymore. Harry. Nobody can stop me. At least I could hear that line for once, because you don't get to hear that uh, often enough. Well, you know, let's if, thank, uh... if, if, if you all don't get the connotation, so there was a, a YouTube rapper by the name of Nianers, or Nianers, however you say it, who did a like a female cover of uh this like mid 2000s rap song called tipsy and when i analyzed the voice oh. it sounded a lot like claudia's english voice actor so i kind of incorporated that into my zoids uh headcanon slash fan fiction whatever and like Everybody. yeah that's what I'm just that now, originated from. That, that that video is now starting to resurface in my head. Yeah. Uh, essentially, lolly anime. Everybody in the coffee <laughs> tipsy. Everybody in the yeah, coffee tipsy. Yeah, that was tipsy. more or less what where that originated from. Like that's the OG. <laughs> right there. Nothing is impossible with a champion. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you die in the last run? <laughs> you think that um you think that Wendy's chili could possibly save us in this uh in these trying times? Shit, Wendy's chili might be the cure for COVID, who knows? Like someone's gonna analyze the actual vaccine, like, oh wait a minute. Isn't it crazy how um, Wings of Serenity was able to like make her own uh, his, his own recipe for um, for uh, chili for like homemade chili? It was beautiful. They said it was better than Wendy's. And one of the I'm craziest parts of his stream was that time that um, he was playing a game. And like someone asked him about his like how he lost all that weight, and he, like, he stopped the whole stream to say, "Look here," because he he was oh, so ex yes. he was so excited, he was really yeah. excited to tell people about his um his weight loss formula. It it's that inner desire to help other people, man. It just shines and it gets them pumped. It's, it's no wonder really. he's one of the most like he's like, one of the number one guys on Twitch right now because. Oh, yeah. Keeps telling his mods, like, invite anybody who ain't watching yeah, streams says, right like, now. Make sure to send this guy a, uh, a gifted sub. Yeah. Having predilections Seems for great. those waifus that could kick his ass, but at the same time, appreciate the princesses. And yes, I am referring to that uh, one part of the club. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's next? Oh, this one's fun. This is my favorite mission. The Kingdom of Arcadia. Oh. I have a very important question for you for this particular mission, but I will save it for when the time comes. Naturally. Naturally. I'll, I'll be on my edge. Let's see. What do I need?
Damn, almost there. One more mission. Do you think it'll actually boost his stats, or will they be about the same? I think it's gonna just win the game for me immediately. As, as soon as I you pick that, it's gonna like immediately just straight up, like the game's gonna end. It's gonna cut to credits. Yeah, congratulations, you are the true champ. And back. What should I do in this mission right now? Should I... No. What should you do? I mean, it play seems like you gotta... Go. Play a match? Go. Go. I play mean... Match. Uh, oh! Oh! Ah! Blue? 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 Ah! <laughs> 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 You're gonna have to. Pre I gotta. Ask, what is going on right now? <laughs> Yikadi! Did you hear that? Your command Did he say Vegeta will be mad at me? Regina. Oh, Regina. My question for this battle is, do you think Regina's gonna beat him when he gets home? Oh. I mean, after that pitiful display, I mean, Harry still had at least three quarters of his health. Yeah, that's a pageant. See, even says blood. Also, so, funny enough, that voice actor is none other than Dan Green. Dan Green? Notice he said Zoids Battlers are nothing more than children's games. Do you think he would go on to play some children's card games? I mean... There's definitely an appeal to it. And... Uh, I'm gonna go with yeah. <laughs> Only if he gets to be like a dimensional uh, demigod, essentially from ancient Egypt, possessing the uh, body of a 12-year-old boy. It's the only way to make it fair. Oh my god. Jesus, Harry. You know what? I got a half a cup of Wendy's chili, you know I'm in a good mood. <laughs> what? I, I didn't catch that first part. You know, whatever. I hope your whole family dies in an automobile wreck. Yeah. Nah, shovels are in my marriage. How bad does things have to be, like the foundation, if anonymous people on the internet can ruin it? Like legitimately ruin it? Nope, 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 I'm straight, I'm straight. <laughs> We're gonna call that the affirmation. <laughs> Another Colorado oh, real player. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. We're totally gay. What was the context of that? Life is strange? Yeah. Oh no. Have you played that? Because I him. haven't yet. I have played that game. Oh, what do you think? I kinda like it. It's like a you know, one of those Telltale style games not made by Telltale. But carrying on the spirit. Yeah. Nah, like I played a little bit of that their Walking Dead series. The only thing I got the, from... uh, the hit song they came out with called The Shuffling Dead. The Shuffling Dead? Yeah. No, I don't think I've heard that one. 
Oh, that's pretty good. You should listen to it. I'll give it a check it out after uh, we're done with these matches here. Speaking of giving it a check out, what do you think of the uh, the Black Gale cocktail recipe? If I had the ingredients, man, I'd make one myself right now. But I forgot to do my shopping. You know what I'm saying? What do you think Lilith would think of that? I mean, it depends on what her uh, mentality is at the time. Uh, if she's the innocent type, she's like, what's this? Tastes good, but kind of funny. <laughs> and all of a sudden gets loopy and forgets that she's a dimensional breaking demigod, I guess, or actual god. I don't know the exact limit. She genuinely, like, she enjoys warping reality. Yep. All of a sudden, she's like, man, this world is twisty. Mm -hmm. and then all of a sudden, everything starts kind of like, you know, spiral affecting. Yeah. I can only imagine their actual first time together. That must be like a total can of worms right there. Oh, God. It's almost not worth trying to imagine right now because I, I just feel dirty for some reason. But I can only hope that Congress Twisted Will will be smacked into shape by that point. Could you imagine, like, uh, Bang's reaction to finding out that, like, Kagura is actually in love? Oh. Um, let's see if I can do a voice for it. But it'd probably be some... Kagura Mitsuki! I see you have finally found someone who could take that twisted will of yours and bend it to shape! It is about time! Could you imagine? What do you think? Needs a little work? But it was only a succubus you could bring that about with anyone. <laughs> a succubus? What? Well, you know, it's a vampire type of, type of a demon. This lady can live off of lust alone. It seems she has found the perfect match in you, then! Problem is, she's a little bit young for her age, and I have to wait a long time before I can fully consummate my ideals. Not to I mention, feel at this point, she's not 100% sure that I love her. I feel like at this point, Bang would just nope right the hell out of there in a pu puff of smoke. <laughs> so, so like, her, like, she's kind of young, and he'd be like, nope. Bloop, 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 bloop. All right, are you ready? Let's do it. Uh, is it time? It is Looks time. Looks about that time. About that time. <laughs> Ten seconds. Could you imagine if he was a WWE champion? Money, somebody would sink to get him. Let's do it then. It's time. About that time. Oh, uh, that, I will admit. That is a badass looking Zoid. Oh yeah, no, the, they actually put a new model out for that as well. It's like it's got shiny gold parts on it, so... <laughs> well, that sounds like a legit Harry Champ model. Oh yeah. Let's do it then. Not you, Claudia. Yeah. There we go. There you go. That's better. The Dark Horn Harry. Perfect. So what do you think of that, Spartacus? I think you're set. 